I'm wearing the same thing as the last video because I'm filming back to back a few videos so that's why I'm wearing the same thing and drinking the same drink. As you can see I only took a sip <laughs> when I was doing the last video. Anywho, so I've got um, a reject shop haul to show you today because I went to the reject shop and bought a few bits so I'll dig in and show you what I bought. Okay first thing Really boring, <laughs> but we bought a pack of Pepsi Max. Um, I think it was like $6, $4, sorry, for six. So we needed drinks because um, my boy was going to a trampoline park afterwards and he needed a drink. So we bought them for that. And, excuse me, darling. You wanna say hello? There you go. Say hello. Hiya. Hi, everyone. <laughs> You're so cute. Can mommy just show everyone what we got? Um, next thing I got was for the car. Um, this is to make the tyres look black. So to make them look new. Um, I've got a lot of things for the car but I didn't have this. So I thought I would try it out and see what it's like. Um, so I want to keep it nice. I want to keep it shiny and, and looking new. So I'm looking forward to using that. And another thing for the car, I thought would be really cool. You know when you're using cloths and you you, you can't really get in like gaps and things properly? Um, I was thinking this microfiber dusting cloth with all these bristles on it might be really good for that. Max, see what you're doing? <laughs> he's, he's got his nose in the stuff. Um, it might be good for getting in amongst like all the ridges and edges and you know like plus it says it lifts and traps dust particles so I thought I would give it a go and see how that works I think that would be really really cool Baxi what are you doing darling it's not a toy he thinks it's a toy it's not a toy my darling <laughs> well you can have it if you want you can have it for now just don't break it. Don't break it. He's trying to kill it. <laughs> don't break it. It's mummy's. It's mummy's. Thank you. Thank you, darling. Thank you. <laughs> you crazy dog. Okay, what's the next thing? This is for Baxter. So, when we walk Baxter and it's dark, we thought this would be really cool because it's got a reflective thing that goes all the way around. So they'll be able to see you in the dark and obviously it's bright orange so he'll be well seen. And it's extra small but that that's the smallest that they had and it's quite big really. So I'm just hoping that it fits. He wants it on, he loves clothes. Honestly, he's like a sucker for clothes. All right, you want it on? Let's put it on. Let's put it on. See if, it, see if it fits. I hope it fits. Right. So it goes round the belly. Look at him. He's, he's like, it goes round my belly. Like that, mummy. Yeah, you do that. Honestly, this dog, he absolutely loves clothes. Don't you? Oh, it's stuck to my jumper. Put that round your belly. Round your belly. And then round here. I know where it goes. I know where it goes. Round there like that. Let's have a look. Round there like that. Let's try to show us. There. Oh, it fits perfect. Oh, look. How nice is that? You look so handsome. You look like you're going to work. You do. Do you look like you're going to work? I can't wait to show your brother. <laughs> oh. Handsome boy. Oh, look. Oh, it's gorgeous. Say hello. He looks so good in it, doesn't he? Doesn't he look like he's going to work? 
<laughs> you do? You think you're going on to... <laughs> Onto the building site. Yeah, <laughs> Aww. I do. Right, what else did we get? We got some round trees randoms. We wanted some sweets and snacks because we're doing the outdoor cinema in a few uh, next weekend. Um, we were going to do it today, but it was throwing it down with rain, um, and we wanted to kind of sit in the trailer and watch the outdoor cinema in the in the nice weather. So we got them for next week. Anyway, they're round trees randoms, and they're just like squishy sweets. I bought because this was cheap as anything um, and it's cold water infusion and it's watermelon strawberry and mint twinings and I'll show you what I got to go with it as well um, it was only two dollars what I got to, to go with it this it's glass it's glass and it's got like a rubber thing going around it and a rubber top and I thought that would be great. It was only two dollars. I couldn't believe it. Um, to put my cold tea infusion in. How much of a bargain is that? I couldn't believe it. I was like, I have to get them together. Fantastic. Also got for snacks when we go to the drive-in theatre, just some sour gummy worms. They're not for you, darling. <laughs> He's like, what's for me? And goodness knows why, but Elliot wanted these. Sunglasses with the Australian flag on. I mean, they're pretty cool, <laughs> but they were only $2. So I said, go on then, you can have them. And also for Elliot, uh, we got some Lynx uh, Xbox. Don't know what that, smells pretty nice. also got some antibacterial wipes in lemon scent I think and just because they were cheap as chips and I needed some and then some more snacks for when we go to the drive-in theatre these are breakaway dairy milk a big bar of breakaway dairy milk just thought that sounded really nice it's got like wafer inside it and we just sing along and this is just for random, this is just for random snacking, but we got McVitie's Digestive digestive Choc Tops in dark chocolate, and they're in individual packs. So, oh no, two individual packs of a few of them. Cream filled digestive biscuits topped with dark chocolate, thought they sounded lovely. Stay here forever. For then I got this really really nice plant pot and the reason why I got this is because I've got when I'm speaking it's vibrating <laughs> I've, got, I've had um, a bamboo plant for seven years we bought it when we moved here from an Aldi and it started off this big in this tiny little purple pot and it grew over the years really really tall I transferred it to another pot um, about a year ago and it sprouted another one so there was him who was really tall and another one that was little next to him he the tall one started to die at the top a few months ago and so because it was dead like this far down I cut the good bit off I googled it first I read up on what to do so I cut that bit off took the rest out of the soil, put this bit in some water and he's survived. So he's actually sprouted roots inside the water and the other one, the little one, is still in the big pot um, and he's doing okay. He seems to be like fluctuating a little bit. He, he's, he's survived, but I don't think they're gonna do too well if I don't 
change up the pot and make it bigger because the pot currently is quite small and this is a big pot so I'm thinking I'm going to put take him out of the water and take him the other one out of the soil put them both in here and I also as well as this bought some potting soil I'll try and bring it up that's quite heavy <laughs> and this was five dollars I think it was five dollars I'll put the prices on the screen anyway so I got some potting soil to put in there. I know there's quite a lot here, but they didn't have any smaller bags. So I thought, oh, I'll, I'll get this. I'll use it for something else anyway. Um, I'm not very good with plants, but these guys I've kept alive for seven years. So I'm not seeing anything happen to them. I want them to survive. So maybe I will, at the end of this, show you me repotting them. Why not? Hey, we'll do that at the end of this. So yeah, um... That was my haul and I hope you enjoyed it. Just wanted to come and show you what I bought because why not? It's what my channel's about, isn't it really? <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed it. Yes, I'm going to fling this um, potting, uh, repotting of my plants on the end and I hope to see you in my next video guys. Stay tuned for the next one. Love you and leave you.